Hello everyone, and welcome back to Dawn of War Dark Crusade Necron Challenge. Hey, I actually did it pretty smooth that time. Nice. Nice, yeah. Uh, we are still attacking the uh, Space Marine main base. And so let's get on with it, shall we? Uh, F1, let's see. Two is that good? One is that good? Okay, um, we can push on their fortress here, or we can take out some stuff here, which won't really impact us. So I think we should move on the base. And it will be slow going. Oh yeah, there's also minefields here, I think. We'll find out soon enough. Uh, let's take out the Dreadnought. Come on, okay, we got a Tomb Spider in on the action, that is nice. Okay, do what you want. Okay, Lord took that out, that is fine. You should be... Nice move on that dreadnought there. All right. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, guys, attack. Okay, don't attack. That's a little strange. Flip. Let's do this. Yeah, okay. Upgrade. I like the Tomb Spiders with the two claws because it's just more damage. That we're just, we're putting on a ranged weapon for their upgrade. Almost there. But having one of the arms as a, uh, I forget what the weapon is actually. <laughs> Um, it does take away from their melee capabilities, and that is what I like the most. So we'll get rid of one of these. How's that? Okay. Oh, we got rid of that too. Well, that's that's a bonus. Hold the east gate at all costs. All right, let's hit them. We got some tanks to take out. And we have some Terminator squad to take out. We got some big stuff here. I'm gonna try to uh, skip on the turrets. They haven't been upgraded. So for the most part, our tomb spiders are okay. Are we missing a tomb spider? We're missing a tomb spider. Where, where did the tomb spider go down? Oh, there. Okay, we are on top of it. That's why I couldn't see it. Uh, 
That's uh, another tomb spider that went down. All right. That's fine. We'll just do that. One tank down. Another one about to go down. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, let's clean this up a little. Let's move. Prepare yourself. Your reckoning is at hand. Preparing yourself for a reckoning. Okay. Let's clean this up a little. That tomb spider should be coming up soon. This fight isn't over yet, but your life is. There we go. Come on, use those rendering claws. That's going to cause a lot of damage. That was upgraded. Damn. Alright, let's go hit this. Oof. Some troops are getting the invisibility, some are not. Ho oh. ho! Wow, okay, come on. Let's go. That's kind of bad for us. Let's go teleport. Let's see if we can punch through. Ah, come on. Let's get you going with that. Escape. And you 
We cannot allow the enemy to claim our relics. This area must be cleansed with orbital fire. The chapter will honor you, brother. There is no honor to be had in defeat. But someone must deliver the targeting beacon. Orbital control. Lock onto this beacon and fire. Full power. Even the elite of the Blood Ravens could not hold back the murderous advance of the Necrons. The Necrons answered the Space Marines' shouted benedictions with stoic silence and murderous blasts from their Goss flares. The aliens were uninterested in any arcane secrets that might have been hidden in North Vandia, utterly ignoring the scorched ruins of the Blood Raven's chapel there. Their gruesome warriors flensed the flesh from every space marine left on the planet, but left their holy battle armors and other relics to corrode in the harsh weather. Tragically, among the flesh reduced to particulate ash was the gene seed of those space marines, dealing a near fatal blow to the chapter. By taking North Vandia, the Necrons defeated the Blood Ravens on Cronus. But by purging the genetic heritage of all those fallen battle brothers, they may well have destroyed the whole chapter. Quite the battle. Sorry I wasn't seeing. I thought it would take a bit longer. Let's see. Uh, what was Death Grip do? Increases damage and health. Well, I think that would be a good choice. More damage? More health? Uh, yes, please. Okay, so that takes care of the uh, Space Marines. Let's see, what are the Orcs going to do? Okay, they didn't do anything. So our goal is to hit here and then here. So let's see how things go. We got everything there. Single large base. Ah, this map. Well, in that case, control one. Now their base is right over here. So I'm just going to send my entire force that way. There is a fast way for the speedrun idea. Let's put the Necron Lord right in there by teleportation. Boom! Start attacking the main base. It works quite well. Let them fight it out. Okay, and you go build there. Got them on the run. Let's see.
kind of getting all spread out. We don't want that. Okay, that's done. Let's get you guys in here and do whatever you want. And we're just going to keep building. Get some more power up. You should be next. You can upgrade this. We have a thousand power, so let's get these going. One sixty. And 180. Oh, that can go there. And then when you're done, when you're done, nothing, because we beat the map. Okay. All right. And now we're on to this one. This one I find annoying. That's why I waited so long to do it. Okay, um, now I'm going to think about what to do next, and there's a few different options, which is pretty cool. But l let me take a look. Okay, we can have a Tomb Spider if we take that, or when we take that, not if. Bulwark, that is a bonus to something. Reduce the cost of garrisoning troops in the province you control. Meh. Um. Flayed ones. Always good. I believe that's the scarabs. That's another crypt warrior squad. That's an advanced base. And that is a destroyer. So there's a couple good things left. That's going to be tough. See all those elites? Ay, hey, jeez. All right, let's uh, take on this. For my dark crusade, great fleet orbital lanes above the battlefields of Cronus on long range flights. Guardsmen and heretic alike had to fight meter by bloody meter with great battle fleets exchanging fire across the skies. Trench warfare seemed an immutable fact of life for commanders on the ground. All this changed with the Battle of Pavonis. This spaceport featured an ancient Adeptus Mechanicus tracking system merged with the alien technologies of the Tau Aircast. This system was sensitive enough to plot courses that avoided orbital fire, making strikes deep into enemy territory possible. A tech priest had discovered this technological marvel and left his servitors to examine it in detail. Whichever force was able to recover, these bionic servants would gain control of the station and be able to launch strikes across Cronus. Okay. <sighs> So this is the only one that is like this. Uh, where's the Lord? There is the Lord. I want you to head over here now. 
That human is a crude melt. We have to collect six of these. But it contains valuable information. Bring it Wait. to the model. There. Go here. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. Okay, so we got two more coming our way. Bring it to the uh, I think it's about here. There. That human is a crude melding of flesh and metal. But it contains valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. The scarabs are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. are analyzing the human hybrid, but we require more of them. That human is a crude melting of flesh and metal, but it contains valuable information. Bring it to the monolith. This one I have to babysit. Not really caring. Okay, that's good. Now... Can you please build this? Okay, so we just need one more. One, two. One, two, three, four. The scarabs are analyzing the their hybrid, but we require more of them. So let's get that up. I need to claim this. Let's get you over here. Okay, good, that's done. Take care of that. Okay, good, we have firepower there. Could you please do that. Get this going. And go claim this.
All right, taking care of that base just fine. Ah, oh, Servitor. You make it out of there. Good for you, Servitor. One, two, three, four. And you get the rest. Two. Oh. That's why we're building up our force. There we go. Go here. Excellent. The living have recovered. A See, there's another one there. Do not let them savor their petty victory. We'll make it not too bad, actually. So we need to get our fourth squad there. They have another one. Servitor is at enemy base one. Soon to be two. Solves that problem. Now I just have this. Ah ha ha ha. So how are we doing? This will help us out. We've broken their morale. Excellent. Perfect. Should be able to take out all four of the scouts there, no problem. Power is flying. That's what I want to see. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Did I just score that? Okay. There it is. Escort. Apparently we're getting a seventh one? <laughs> okay. There we go. Wow. 
That was pretty good. I'm going to hit end turn and see what happens. Tower getting way too strong. Way too strong. It's tempting to hit that, honestly, for the Tomb Spider, but... Probably this. Let's give it a try. Take something away from the Tau. Okay, control one. There is a enemy base right here. Go to it, guys. If we can take that player up, because I think it said two players, so I wasn't paying attention. But strength of six should equate to two players. And this map can be tricky. It can sneak up on you, and boom, that's it. Game over. Don't care about the Wraith. Good as a scout. Necron scout. How are we doing here? Big thing is to get rid of their stationary guns, which they normally don't have turrets in this version. Rid of this. And everybody on that. Unload, please. Unload. things get a little bit weird. You gotta leave room for these tomb spiders. There, player defeated. The next player is over here, I think. So I'm going to pull back for a bit. If we go to attack and get all of our elites wiped out, I mean, it's not a problem replacing them, but we'll be at a disadvantage. We don't have any plasma generators as of yet. So that's not a very good thing. Let's put you there. Okay, now... Just upgrade, but now we have a bit of room. We can get a few plasma in here. We can also upgrade. I just need 300. Good movie. I did enjoy it. Uh, where 
where would be a good place? Yeah, I think over here. Do what you can there. All right. Oops. But you're almost done, so let's get you on this. I goofed on that. Oopsie. Okay, now we almost had 300. Not even close. And where's the lower? There. Okay, control one. Yay! Oh, why did I do that? I don't want to do that. Go there. Come on! I only have one squad that is upgrading right now. Or, you know, strengthening. So that I can get surplus happening of the power so I can get an awakened monolith. There. Is that... yeah, that's the last one. Okay. Um... We'll wait until the part... yes? Oh. There we go. That's awesome. So we can upgrade these. Or... Work on something else, which I think I'm going to do. Work on this. And that. So they're not exactly in the center, but they're in this corner, opposite of ours, which makes sense. Let's forget about those. No, focus on the buildings. That's what we want. Come on, that's what we want. Listen to your programming. Your programming is greater than your will. After all, you are only warriors. Almost there. God. 
for 15 conquests. War gear awarded. Uh, death round was that to increase the speed, reduce damage from range attacks. Uh, that's pretty good. Um, let's take it. And we can do one more attack. We could hit this one. Why don't we hit this one? Actually, why don't we go for the Tomb Spider? I think that will be a really good choice. And since we have such a strong elite force, it should be very easy to take him out. Well, that is if I actually know where the, uh, the base is. I know where the base is. Go here, please. Control one. Let me know when you get there. Of course, it's on the other side of the map, you know? That should not be a surprise. <laughs> Please go here. We will, of course, get some warriors out. I need you over here. You have a special job. Going to bring up another monolith. There we go. Thank you. Okay, we have our force in position now. Please go to here. This is another one of those maps, if you don't pay attention, it will eat you. Even on normal. A hundred. Okay. We are almost in position. Uh, let's do an attack move. Go up to here. There. Um. Can we do any more? Is that the last one? Uh, well, kind of the last one, but not the last one of the last one, and we need more. So, okay, our forces are almost in position. The enemy base is here. Oh, all right. Now, okay, we got a third squad. I want that there. Okay, now happy attack. Go there. Now, that's much better. Much better.
I'm just going to... Ah, we're attacking something. Let's see what's up. <laughs> the Servitor learns how to fly. Usually not in their mandate, but okay. I'm not going to object. Again, we'll wait for the rest of our force. We're at 60, 70, nice. So we can almost handle three squads going full upgrade. 80. Liking it so far. I think we can handle it now. Okay, right now. One attack, go to this point. We're going to park ourselves outside the entrance here, and we will hit it in a moment. Uh, sorry if you can hear the siren. I doubt it. It's pretty far away. Ah, there we go. Nicely done. So the last thing is upgrading. Upgrading and continuing to build. Please go claim that. And you lovely gents and ladies, please move this way. The robots have no gender, but the minds that were transferred into it did. Not that they know that anymore. Nope. Oh, upgrade. There we go. All right, let's move in. Destroy everything in our path. Okay, you are crushed, you are crushed, you are crushed, and now it's their captain. Force commander, I force you to kneel with a club to the head. Eh, it works. Ignore the scouts. Push on this. Ready? And go fire. Blow this up, and as the scouts sneak by, they get decimated. You guys haven't recovered yet. See? You should have moved further back. I understand your space marines, but we're Necrons. Force Commander is like practically down. Uh, we're going to have Space Marines pop out in a second. And fire. We got a Chaplain!
That is totally done down there. We've won this map. So I'm going to claim this, or claim it, no, build it. And hopefully I can before that's destroyed. It's going to be close. Got it! Yeah, it was pretty close. So let's go Commander and get this right now. In case if we're attacked. Uh, because we're going to be hit by, uh, like, a strength 10 if the Eldar hit us. But that'll happen in the next video. Well, the end turn button will happen in the next video. So I do hope that uh, you enjoyed this video. And if you're new to the channel, you can subscribe down below for more videos like this and of other videos. You can also subscribe to my Twitter as well as my Twitch channel. Links down below in the description. But until next we meet, please do be safe, everyone. Bye.